We're gonna teach you guys how to uncurl my mustache today. We start with this bottle of distill. I'm just kidding, I'm just kidding. How's it going everybody? We have a method that is a little different from every other video on YouTube so far. Uh, we use a humidor because the humidity is what's causing your foils to curl. If That's there's right. too much humidity in the air versus where the card was printed, the card's going to expand past what the foil coating can expand because the foil coating really doesn't expand. It doesn't take on humidity more. That's right. You ever get dry skin, Paul? Uh, in the wintertime in Canada because it's super dry, like right now where we are in Canada. It's kind of like what's happened with magic cards, right? There's not enough moisture or too much moisture depending on the shape of and your curl, right? Where you live. That's right. Which basement you live in. But uh, around here it's dry. So our curl is like this. So that's what happens when the card is hanging out in air that is drier than that's where right. the card was printed. And all the moisture leaves the paper. Into the air. You ready? Let's go. Woo! Hey guys. Morgan. Showing you some curled foils from a secret layer. Here we are. Okay, these are pretty curled cards. Uh, we're going to show you today how to fix these. Okay? And it all starts with this cigar humidor right here. So you take your sponge and you put some water in it, which I have already done. Okay, it goes in the humidor and you stick your cards in here, just like this. All right, then you wait. Good night. Goodbye. A lot of boring math later. Here we are, Paul. Fixing day. So how long has it been? It, uh, we have put the, we put the cards in on Thursday of last week, and it is now Tuesday of the following week. So we have Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday in the box. Okay. Monday in the box. Let's get this going. Okay, and go. Here we are. Is what the uh, we did some secret layers that we bought the full art text, and this is how they showed up to the studio. So we wanted to show you how to fix that problem. Look at this. Look at this planes. Interesting results. Look at the, would you look at that, Paul? He's got his humidity back in order. This uh and look, look at the back. The back and there's no damage or anything like that. No water damage. So you know it's not like we just chucked her into a bowl of water, dried her over the hair dryer or anything. <laughs> Eighth place Dave. Uh, but uh here is uh this one. It's starting to go the other it's way. Starting to go the other way too because much there's humidity. too much humidity, and that's okay because you know what? You could just let this sit out for a few more days, uh, outside of the box, and uh, we're gonna stick some other ones into the box, just for fun, so we don't have curled cards. This is so much fun. Good night. Good night. Goodbye. Not bad, eh? Seriously. Uh, so no damage to the cards. They look flat now. And uh, now you can double sleeve your card and properly store it so the moisture can't escape the paper anymore and that won't happen again. Okay, you didn't need to get an expensive heavy press or 15 books or roll it around a tube that you got something round in. You don't have to you, put it, the iron onto it. We no, see you guys um, ironing their magic cards, which I would never ever do. And <laughs> oh, okay, uh, I also see another, uh, we see another video where somebody takes like a round hard cardboard tube and they wrap their magic card around it. And sure, guys, but you you know what you did? You just... Uh, you stretched it, right? You stretched the paper. You didn't fix anything. Don't give your card stretch marks. In a day or two, it's going to go back to the same shape it was because it doesn't have enough moisture in it. That's true. So The key is once you get that humidity right in your card, it's double it. Sleeve, it, sleeve it and just keep it out of as much air transfer as possible. That's right. Uh, stop the osmosis from happening, That's right? That's right. So if you're looking to get a humidor for yourself, you can check out Amazon. You can get a cheap one for 30 to 40 bucks with a little window on top too, so you can check it every day without opening it. It's pretty cool. Or... But keep in mind, if you buy the one with the window, don't keep it in sunlight. UV is harmful to magic cards. That's right. Just... If you're more of a serious commander player, we recommend this hmm. one here. It's uh, 
It contains so much space for your commander decks, Warrior. Two commander decks at a time, most likely. Oh, man. Man. If you're playing with that many foils, it's going to run you closer to 500 bucks. <laughs> but still, you could mass uncurl foils for people and start a little business. Yeah. <laughs> so it's pretty simple if you got some foils that you really want to uncurl. We recommend doing it this way. It doesn't stretch the card, in our opinion. It's and just resetting it to factor default. And if you're new and, you, and you're just going to attempt this for the first time and get a, a humidor, practice on something not valuable first okay? commander legends commons foils <laughs> ask paul yeah. when i first started when we first started this i had this at my house and i put a bunch of stuff in there and you know it slipped my mind a week or two <laughs> went by i went back and the foil was coming off the card it was so reverse curled uh, and now i was learning i, I maybe used too That's much right. water practice um, first but it's not hard right like we just showed you in the two quick videos those four or five days apart yep done Double sleeve it after that. Try and store your cards fairly tight together if you're putting them in a deck box. Like, try to have something in the deck box that makes it sit yep. snug in the sleeve, some styrofoam or whatever you got, extra tokens, doesn't matter. That also helps. But yeah, if you double sleeve them and you're using, like, let's say a perfect fit and then another sleeve, you should be half decently okay as far as moisture transfer goes. It shouldn't yeah, it'll leave, take so a while to curl back. A long time. Yep. All right, guys, that's it. Don't forget to like, sub. Share the video. Do it. Uncurl some foils. Leave a comment. Peace. Woo!